Hey people, it's me, Kira. Hi. Hello. Hi. So today in this video, I'm going to be doing a what's in my school bag slash college stationery haul. Um, so um, I'm going into college, so year 12 and uh, I'm going to be studying at level three acting. So it's not something that would require loads and loads of station, like loads of books or something. Um, but I do have quite a lot in my bag. I was researching and then drawing this. So the first, my first day is on Wednesday. Uh, so I do have a few extra things in my bag that I won't be taking with me every day at school college but I just want to show you guys what's in there now so the bag I'm taking is really heavy the bag I'm taking is this brown um, leather super dry bag it's pretty big and I really like the brown one and this is a really good size I don't know if you can tell, but in comparison to me. But there's obviously two handles and then there's also a zip on the inside so that you can do the bag up as a whole. And then inside there's a zipped compartment and then there's two open compartments that you can kind of like slide your phone into or something. So let's get started. So the thing that isn't going to be in here all the time is this big black folder, which is actually really heavy. Don't really know where it's from. Um, I just kind of found it in my attic. <laughs> I wanted it. Um, but it just zips up like this. Um, at the moment, it's got all my certificates and um, uh, like exam results and that. But on this side, there's a section for a pen and like little slidey sections. And then all this is plastic wallets. And then there's a notebook. Or a notepad at the back, and that notepad came with the folder, so it's pretty cool. So my folder for college, this one um, is from W H Smith. It's a twenty pocket display book. It's A4, um, and it's just a clear, uh, slim line at the moment folder. Um, it's like this material so it's easy to fit in and it's not the big bulky ones um it's already got what 20 plastic wallets inside um i think this this was actually such a good price i think it's got to be like 199 or 299 um does it say no it doesn't say on it but um it's just a white well clear one and I've also got like one of the big bulky ones, it's a pastel one that I got from also Ruby Hicks Smith, um, which will be staying at home with me, which is why I haven't included it in this video. But this is just gonna have like homework, important work, um, worksheets, and scripts. My pencil case this year is also from Ruby Hicks Smith. It was $7.99 and it's it's translucent, it's not completely transparent, but it's holographic. I don't know if you can see the reflection of all the lights. Um, and it's just, oh, it's also got polka dots on it too. And it's just kind of like a rectangle, a nice little one. So inside I have the um, Stablo um, highlighters at the end. These aren't brand new, I've had, I got these when I joined, started year 11. Um, so, yeah, it's just all of the pastel highlighters, which I put in there. Still got tags and everything because I wanted to keep it all new for this specific video. Um, I've also got my glasses. And then I've got my notebook, which is from Typo, and it's a Compo notebook, which is actually... Uh, like the ones they have in America, Compass, I think, or Canvas. Like, correct me if I'm wrong. Um, this was £3.50 from Typo. I don't know if I already said that. It looks like this. It's literally the whole same print um, 
bonnets that the ones in America have and that's a little quote there um I don't really know I should blur this out but here it is anyway and then you can just put your name at the front and then it's just all lined paper on the inside and it's just really nice it's not a four it's maybe a five um but it's just really cute and I believe you don't do too much writing so it's not necessary to have a big notebook so this is what I've gone for and I may also end up taking my iPad and my Apple Pencil into school at college so this one book is perfectly fine. So for my writing pens this year I've actually gone for two different brands. Um, I've got the Papermate Ink Joy Oh, just move ink, boy point, boy, ball point, comfortable grip pens. There's four of them, and it's the 1.0 millimeter medium. These are the medium point ones. I like these ones because they're not too thick, and but then they're not really thin. And it's the Inkjoy ones. I don't know if you guys ever tried any of the Inkjoy pens, but they are so smooth. And I've got them in the color black because I personally like to write in black rather than blue there's there are four in here and then the other pens i've got which i mainly just got them because they look really pretty are the um zebra z grip smooth pens um i believe they're black yes black ink um but they're the parcel versions i think they are really pretty there's only three in here um i can't remember how much they were and i i think the pens are about three or four ninety nine these, I can't remember, I got them from Tesco, I was actually walking around and I saw them and I really liked them. Um, and I just thought they were really pretty, as I've already said. And that's it really, I'm not really too sure how well these ones write or anything like that, but they just look nice. We will probably have to be drawing out things for um, acting like stage designs and set designs etc. So I've got a ruler because I can not draw a straight line. This is the WH Smith's own folding rule, uh, 30 centimetres and it's just clear. I didn't really fancy getting, getting a colour, I actually can't speak. I didn't fancy getting a coloured one so I just got a cleared one, a clear one and then it just folds and snaps and you can just open it back up, which I only have a 15 centimeter pencil case so half of 30 is 15 again i don't know how much that was but i think it was in the pence so for drawing to a complement my ruler i got some pencils i got the zebra classic mechanical pencils the 0.5 millimeter ones they've got the rubber bit around the writing area and they have an eraser, the end, they're just the, oh and they're refillable, Ooh. they're just the classic mechanical pencils, there's four of them, there's a orange, green and blue and black. And the lead isn't too bad, you can just see it on the orange one and it actually looks a really nice thicknessness. Um, I'm not really a massive fan of mechanical pencils, I usually go the actual like HB pencils, but I decided to get mechanical pencils specifically for college. I'm actually really happy about this purchase. I decided to get um, different ones this year. Um, I got the Papermate Ink Joy pens. These are the new ones and they actually dry three times faster for reduced smearing. So that's just brilliant. They're a gel pen, um, comfortable grip, 0.7 millimeters, and they're medium point pens, and there's 10 of them. And they look really pretty just in the packet. And there's two available sizes, so you could get a 0.5 or a 0.7. I went for the 0.7. I don't know why on the back it says 14. Wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 8, 9, 10. So there is 10 but the back it says 14, look, 14 colours. But yeah, so these ones are really nice and they're gel pens so 
if you love that and they're just pink, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, a different shade of blue, purple, a dark purple and another black which matches my ones I've already got. Um, so technically I've got five of these black pens but these are just great. So coming off the stationery side I've actually um, bought this, what is inside? Oh I've put stuff inside. So um, from the Pete Smith I bought this pen, well it's called a pencil case um, but it's just a rose gold um, thingy bag, there is a word for it but I don't know it. Um, and it's quite a good size, same size as my pencil case but a little bit thinner. Um, and it says busy being me on it, I don't know if you can focus on that. So you open it up, it's actually really hard the sizes. So this is kind of like an emergency kit. So um, inside I got some aloe vera anti back hand sanitizer. Got some tissues, these are really cute from um, Accessorize. And this one says girls just want to have free Wi-Fi. And um, it's just, oh, Typo. They're from Typo. They used to be from Accessorize. Accessorize used to do these. These were, wow, these were 50p. What part are they? These are 50p and when you open it up, it's like a little book and either side of it has tissues. I don't know how many tissues. It's just like quite a few. It's probably about five. Yeah, so there's five on each side. So you get ten tissues, but I bought two of these. I got another one, but I don't know what that one looks like. I think it's pink. And then from MS, not Spencer. Um, they've got these little mini essentials. So um they were all a pound each, I believe. I got this mini fresh mint breath spray. Because when you're acting, you're going to be face to face with people. And if you've just had lunch, it's quite handy to have some mouth spray. Obviously, you can use gum as well, too. But, like, you, if you're performing or something, you don't want to be like. So, you know, I'm just being respectful to others. Then we've got this MS hand cream it softens and moisturizes i don't actually know what this smells like um oh it's wait what it actually it's just a really plain scent it doesn't really smell of anything it doesn't even say what it's meant to smell of to be fair so i wasn't really expecting anything special oh they're cruelty free and then I've got some m and lip balm. It's, it's quite small. Um, and it just gently moisturises and notches your lips. Ooh. It smells really fresh, like mint, as if there's mint on it, but it doesn't say. Oh, with a hint of mint. That actually smells so good. Um, as you can see, I'm very organised on the stationary side of things, but for my little emergency kit, I haven't really done much to it. Um, but it's fine. Oh, and I just wanted to show you the bag empty. So again, this is the outside, and I kind of forgot to mention about the detail on here on this side so it's got super dry printed and I don't know if you can see it's kind of sparkly yeah it is meant to be sparkly I was just seeing so it actually looks really nice in the light um and inside looks like this it's a really big space inside actually um if I just hold it open like that so you can see here there's a big pocket here and then I was like, yeah, it's two big. Oops. Okay. So just one big pocket inside, and then to the right, my right of that, there's a zipped compartment, which is where you can put all your lady things in there. So everything fits really nicely. So guys, that is everything that I've got for college 2019 to 2020. 
Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe in the button and hit the notification bell to be notified when I next upload and you can also go ahead and comment down below in the comment section any nice things you have to say or video requests because any ideas. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.